I am Dr. Sanjay Gupta. I am a qualified physician in internal medicine. I have been practicing for last 25 years. In Stanford Hospital, I have been here for last 2 to 3 years in Kaikondrahalli. A teenage girl um, having shortness of breath again points out to various factors uh, which should be investigated. And uh, what you rightly asked is that there must be something wrong why a young girl should face these problems. Uh, first, very common thing which is existing in India as well as in our societies is iron deficiency in India. So when we say it's a teenage girl, we always know that she must be having menstrual problems there. She must be or she can be losing more blood or her diet must be affected because uh, teenagers may have a habit of fast food. Uh, maybe there is a nutrition uh, not coming easily or not coming uh, handy uh, where they are actually eating good food, nutritious food which has iron content. So the point which I am trying to make is uh, iron deficiency or vitamin deficiency uh, is quite common in teenagers, especially in a teenage girl who is menstruating. So that is something which has to be investigated. and. Um, it is quite reversible. So believe it or not that if you treat iron deficiency, uh, a teenager who is having breathlessness or shortness of breath while walking and doing work uh, will go away. But if you leave it like that, then there is a lot of cardiovascular manifestations which will take place. So that is something which has to be investigated and treated and luckily it is reversible. Also when uh, a girl is in her teens, uh, we will also try to look at her thyroid. So thyroid is one more deficiency or uh, uh, hyperthyroidism in teenagers which can also lead to some problems like uh, breath, uh, shortness of breath and also weakness. Likewise there can be more uh, problems. Sometimes I have also um, experienced that after investigating you might not come out with any conclusion of organic problems. It can be anxiety. It can be uh, mood changes, it so can be behavioral changes where uh, a person can feel uh, very tired or weak uh, after a certain course of uh, work as well as uh, while sitting, uh, even not doing anything. There might be a factor which can lead to breathing problems. So we will have to investigate all round uh, and if we don't come across any problems, then we will have to counsel the patient.